Hello everybody, it is me, Mr. Io here, back for another video, and today I've got something pretty neat to show you guys. So, I actually built an 8-bit multiplier. It's relatively compact as well, it's just I vertically stacked all the adders, so it's, uh, it's pretty much just a box. Uh, it could be a little more compact if the adders were one tall, but that would make it a lot wider. So I, I chose this because it is, in the end, still more compact. Um, yeah, so here, I'll, I'll show you some numbers we can input. Alright, so I'm thinking we're going to maybe put in a couple sets of numbers here and try it out. Uh, for the first one, we'll do, uh, you know what, we'll do 5 times 5. 5 times 5. Let's see here, we get 1. 8 and 16, so 1 plus 8 is 9, 8 plus 16 is 25, and 5 times 5 is 25, so there we go, that's the answer. Um, we'll try another one here, maybe something a little more complex. How about we do 11, so that's 11, okay, 8 plus 2 is 10, plus 1 is 11, 11 times, uh, we'll do 11 times 9. Okay, um, so uh, 9 will be 1 plus 8. Now, let's see here. So, 1 plus 2, that's 3. 3 plus 32 is 35. 35 plus 64 is 99. And 11 times 9 is 99. So, yeah, it, it definitely does work. Um, I believe that the delay, like how long it takes for numbers to go through. I believe it's about 38 ticks, which is pretty reasonable. Um, this could obviously be made more, it can be made faster, but it would be larger. So I think this is pretty compact design, at least for, uh, for what it is. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any comments or you wanna get in contact with me, make sure to join the Logic World Discord. It'll be in the description below. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See ya.